Hi friends. The other book that I want to read this week is called Coat of Many Colors. Back through the years, I go wandering once again. Back to the seasons of my youth. I recall a box of rags that someone gave us and how my mama put the rags to use. There were rags of many colors, but every piece was small and I didn't have a coat and it was way down in the fall. Mama sewed the rags together, so in every piece with love, she made my coat of many colors that I was so proud of. As she, sew as she sewed, she told a story from the Bible as she read about a coat of many colors Joseph wore. And then she said, I hope this coat will bring you good luck and happiness. And I just can't wait to wear it. And Mama blessed it with a kiss. My coat of many colors that my Mama made for me, made only from rags, but I wore it so proudly. It's a pretty coat. Look at all the different colors in her coat. Although we had no money, I was rich as I could be in my coat of many colors my mama made for me. So with patches on my britches and holes in both my shoes, in my coat of many colors, I hurried off to school. Just to find the others laughing and making fun of me and my coat of many colors my mama made for me. The other kids, they're not being very nice, are they? It's not nice to laugh at people and make fun of them. And oh, I couldn't understand it, for I felt I was rich. And I told them of the love my mama sewed in every stitch. And I told them the story mama told, told me as she sewed and how my coat of many colors was worth more than all their clothes. But they didn't understand it, and I tried to make them see that one is only poor only if they choose to be. Now I know we had no money, but I was rich as I could be in my coat of many colors my mama made for me made just for me. Her mom made her pretty coat. Her mom sewed it and she spent a lot of time making it and she put a lot of love into it. That was a good story. I like that one. The coat of many colors. All right. I hope you guys have a great day today. I'll see you later. Goodbye.